Hello and welcome back to Nexus Mods. Today we're looking at Fallout New Vegas and I'm going to show you exactly how to get started with modding. We're keeping this beginner friendly, so don't worry if you've never modded anything before. By the end, you'll know how to set up your game, why you need tools like Vortex, NVSE and the 4GB patch and how to install your very first mods. First things first, you'll need to install your copy of Fallout New Vegas. Steam or GOG work best. Once you've got the game installed, make sure to launch it and navigate to the title screen and then close the game down. This will make sure all your initial files have been generated correctly before we start modding. Now, let's talk Vortex. Could you install mods manually? Sure. Do you want to? Probably not. Manual installs mean digging through folders, dragging files around and trying to remember what belongs where. Mess up once and your game might not even launch. Vortex solves all of that. It's the official Nexus Mods Manager, designed to handle downloads, installations, load orders, the works. Once you've got Vortex downloaded, log in with your Nexus Mods account. You'll then need to let Vortex know that you want to manage Fallout New Vegas. Click Games, search for Fallout New Vegas and click Manage. Unfortunately, even when using Vortex, there's still a few essential files that we've got to sort out before the game is ready for modding. You see, the base game scripting language is super limited and was never designed for the scale of today's mods. The New Vegas Script Extender, or NVSE, injects additional scripting functions and events so modders can do amazing things such as create custom perks, combat behaviour or even add new and exciting dynamic quests. Luckily, Vortex knows how important the script extender is and will prompt you to download it when you manage New Vegas. Alongside NVSE, you'll need two other tools, the 4GB patcher and NVAC, New Vegas Anti-Crash. These are both great tools that expand the capabilities of Fallout New Vegas, so let's grab them now. For the 4GB patcher, you'll need to download and unzip the file, place it in your Fallout New Vegas game directory and run it from there. It'll tell you when it's patched the game successfully. Last up, download NVAC, the New Vegas Anti-Crash, which you can install through Vortex. And with that, you're ready to begin your modding journey with Fallout New Vegas. So why don't we have a look at how to do that? Head to Nexus Mods, choose Fallout New Vegas and browse. You can sort by most endorsed, popular or search for whatever you're interested in. Once you've picked your mod, always check the requirements section on the mod page and ensure you have what you need installed. Some mods need other mods to work. When you're ready, click the vortex button on the top right Vortex will grab it, install it, and you just need to click Enable. Done. One of the best things about Vortex is how safe it makes experimenting. If a mod causes issues, you can disable it instantly with one click. No digging through game folders. You can also create different profiles. Think of these as separate mod setups. One profile could be a hardcore survival playthrough. Another could be a heavily modded roleplay run. Switching between them takes seconds. And that's it. You've just learned how to mod Fallout New Vegas using Vortex. From here, the possibilities are endless. Better graphics, bug fixes, new quests, and whole new ways to play. If this helped, make sure to subscribe for more guides, watch out for more Fallout content coming soon, and of course, explore Nexus mods to see what inspires you. Thanks for watching and happy modding.